Hello, welcome everybody, it's KB here. So, I managed to install Google Play Store on Windows 11 and also I managed to sign in, but there is a tiny problem when you sign in, okay? So this is going to be incomplete tutorial, okay? So first of all, if you don't know what and how to get the uh, Android system on Windows 11, then I have made a video on it. It's called Windows Subsystem for Android. It's a new feature which allows you to run the Android apps on Windows 11. It's pretty cool, okay? So this is what the tutorial is about, okay? So this system comes with no Google Play Store or no Google Play services. So yesterday I spent a lot of time to fix this issue. I installed Google Play Store. I installed Play services, but things didn't work that well. But I somehow managed to make it better at least, okay? So this is like a kind of, a, not a tutorial, it's like kind of a help, asking for help. I'm asking for help. Maybe someone uh, who watched this video will figure out how to fix this issue, okay? First of all, I downloaded the Google Play Store APK from the APK Mirror. I will put link in the description, you can go there download it and second i did not download the google play services instead i downloaded micro g i will put link in the description for this too okay this is the open source uh, application which replaces the google play services and works better and actually uh, in this case this is the only thing that works uh, i tried with the uh, google play services uh, but I wasn't able to open the sign-in option. When I click on the sign-in option, when I have the Google Play services installed, it won't do anything, okay? I was able to uh, open the Google Play Store, but I wasn't able to log into my account. So I will put link in the description for the both links. That's all you need to run the Google Play Store and Play services, that's all. So uh, here's the thing. So first of all, maybe some of you guys are confused. Uh, if you don't know how to install a APK on Windows 11, then I have made a video on it. You can go there and watch and learn how to install a APK. So once you learn how to install a APK, you can install this Aurora store, which is alternative to Google Play Store almost. Uh, it's, uh, it's pretty good, but you know, since we don't have a Google Play services, some apps will never work. So that is the reason why we need Google Play Store. So from here, Aurora Store, I downloaded this DuckDuckGo uh, browser and this is the one actually works with this. I tried Chrome, I tried Opera, I tried Edge. None of them worked well. They open crash or something like that, but this worked. So if you're looking for a browser, uh, Android browser for the Windows 11, then this is the one that will work perfectly, okay? So this is how I did it. And now, you know, once you have a side-loaded application or app store or a browser, uh, since I have the side-loaded browser, DuckDuckGo, now I can just uh, download the APKs within the Android system and double click, I don't have to do anything, just install it. So this is how it is working, okay? So first you just need to learn how to sideload a application. So once you sideload a browser, after that you don't need to sideload any application. Just download the APK files within the uh, Android system and open the files in Android. So you can see there is this. Just open the file and it will open the file. I did it twice, so I'm gonna have to close it. Okay, so that's the thing, okay? So now I'm gonna install the Google Play Store, easy peasy, just like you install on your phone, okay? And now I'm gonna install the Micro G, which is alternative to Google Play services, all right? So as I said, the original Google Play services doesn't work as of now. So this is the reason why I'm using the micro G from the GitHub page. So that's that. So I'm done installing and you will see that Google Play Store is here. And it is working. Yeah, I'm going to click on it. And you can see I have the sign in option. All right, I'm going to click on sign in. Yay. 
looks like this time it will work so actually with micro g you will have the option to sign in it will open the option to sign in if you install the google play services it will not it will not give you any option it will just you you, you click 100 times in the sign in option it won't do anything so here i'm gonna sign in let me show you the real problem here all right so time to hit next i have entered my id and password there hit next okay and uh, i'm gonna agree to terms and condition very good it looks like it's working yeah but the problem here is that this is the main problem okay i managed to install google play store and i managed to install uh, play services but this is the main problem here it says there was a problem communicating with Google servers. Try again later. And I tried many times by installing different uh, Google Play services too, but it did not work. So this is the problem. So yeah, as I said, this is a incomplete tutorial, okay? <laughs> so if you know how to fix it, or maybe you will figure out by yourself. So I will put link in the description for the Google Play Store app and the uh, micro g you can go there download them and install them maybe it will work on your device or maybe you will figure out something or if you know how to fix this issue you can't sign in then let me know in the comments yeah that's it this is not even a tutorial i'm just asking for the help and this is like if this works this is going to be the easiest way to install google play store and services if this works and this is how far i have come i know in future people will figure out to install google play services and all that uh, but as of now i think this is the i don't know best or worst thing i don't know okay so until we fix this issue together as a community all right uh, we can use this uh, aurora store okay i will also put link in the description for this so until google play store is getting fixed uh, you can use this and uh, download any application and whatever you want so as you know uh, my uh, amazon store comes with almost garbage apps there are not enough applications there are some games and only games but if you manage to install aurora store which is easy to install just sideload it i have made a tutorial on how to install a apk on uh, windows 11 so easy peasy so you know compared to the amazon app store this is better choice for now okay when we will be able to use the google play store on our windows 11 that would be the complete android system so let me show you actually i think this the performance of this android subsystem is just fantabulous yes that's a word okay i'm just gonna download one game any any game uh, maybe i don't know stick war or something i don't know okay i'm just gonna download this all right uh any game you can see all the games you see here you can download them and play them actually all right wow there is a pubg mobile also really wow i gotta test this i'm gonna make a video on the android games on windows 11 thingy i'm just gonna test the uh, performance of the game i think pubg mobile is the one of the heaviest game all right so i think i installed yeah i installed the game just look at it i'm just going to click on it and look how fast it opens it's like i'm running a native uh, windows software or game and you can see it is also playable i know this is a just tiny bit of game you know but you can see it is working so just imagine once we get the google play store working in this system it's gonna be amazing and there is one more problem which i will just say it right now uh, i don't think as of now um, there is any key mapping tool like you know if you want to play pubg or something like that 
the game requires too many clicks uh controls you know i think uh, it's gonna uh, i don't know in future maybe people will make some kind of a application or software which allows you to key map the game and all that but you know uh maybe in next video i'm just gonna uh, do a performance test it, that i just want to test the games heavy games like pubg mobile or something okay so you can see running like fantabulous all right <laughs> So that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, yeah, please download the Google Play Store and the MicroG and try if it works or not. And maybe you know the uh, reason. Okay, uh, maybe I'm too dumb to fix this issue, but maybe we all together can fix this issue. Okay, that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, yeah, I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye bye.